Hey guys, I figured I'd make a part two of this. Uh, iTunes match is almost finished up. Um, said 986 songs of my 1434 were already in the cloud. So uh, if you're not familiar with the iTunes match, it's $24.99 a year. You subscribe. Basically, if your songs exist in iTunes, it uh, doesn't upload. But if your music, you know, may not be in iTunes now, it'll match that and upload it for you. So then it's available on all your devices. So for example, um, any iOS device uh, run iOS 5 or greater. Uh, for example, I'm going to jump over here to my, uh, this is the iPhone 5 here. Uh, if you just go under uh, settings and then under, uh, pardon me, uh, music, you see this uh, options built right in, iTunes match. Now because I've already subscribed, we just need to go ahead and turn that on. So select the radio button. It's going to want my password. So let me put my password in here real quick. Okay, I've entered my password. Let me hit OK. Now it says iTunes Match will replace the music library on your device. Now if you don't want to do that, uh, obviously select Cancel. Um, now the songs that are presently on my iPhone 5 are just uh, of the recent 91 songs that I happened to purchase from iTunes. That's all that's on there, so I actually don't care if it replaced that. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and enable that. Now you can see iTunes Match is on and show all music is selected. That's an option you wouldn't have before. And it says all music that has been downloaded or that is stored in iCloud will be shown. So basically I still have this process going um, of the iTunes match. It seems to go in a loop of checking what's left and then keep trying to check the last remaining one. So I don't know if it's Apple's way of drilling down into the song more to find a match so it can be more efficient. My guess is yes, but I'm going to investigate that a little bit more. But nonetheless here, um, like I said, I've got all that uh, selected iTunes match and show all music. So now I'm assuming if I go under music, uh, if you click here under songs, as you can see here, I never had never that many songs before. That is actually pretty awesome because instead of having to sync an entire device library, iTunes match just allows me to play those songs through the cloud. Now... I am going to, uh, this will be a part two video of iTunes Match. I'm actually going to make a part two video on my channel for the Kenwood uh, Exelon, the DNX9990 HD, the screen I have in my car, uh, because I Bluetooth my song, so I was just getting ready to actually add more music to my iPhone 5 to Bluetooth, but now that this iTunes Match has come up, I'm thinking I'm just going to flip on Bluetooth and now have my entire music collection no matter what, wherever, wherever I'm at. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and activate this through the iPad, so I may make a part 3 video of iTunes Match just to show you guys that. Um, I may not. So, uh, like I said, uh, again, folks, that's iTunes Match uh, Part 2. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, please uh, subscribe, and I'll continue making these with or without you. just uh, would enjoy some support, comments, feedback. Uh, thanks, guys and girls.